Hello everyone and welcome to Whitetail Driven Solutions YouTube channel. We are bringing you tips, strategies, and tactics to help you and your property be more successful. We not only invite you to subscribe to our channel, but also hit the notification button to be notified when we release new videos. Morning guys, Josh here. With shed hunting just around the corner, there is one shed hunting day that I'll never forget. 2007, March 7, 2007, I was uh, out on a farm that we had had for a couple of years doing a sweep of an area that I had uh, looked for sheds there before and that, that year we actually had quite a bit of snow in that area here in Michigan and was trying to uh, just find um, you know odds and ends sheds but I didn't know what I was up what I was about to experience uh, that morning in the, in the woods. When I came across these I started actually in the food plot and I, ne I didn't find anything there. We had picked horns before on that uh, plot already that season, so it, it wasn't a big surprise I didn't find any. And then I started down that into that area um, onto that to try to find that that ridge system where those sheds that I had found before. And what I had, what I like I said, what I was about to experience, I'll never forget. Walked up on there, and all I could see is about like you can see in the video I can see about this much you know just a couple inches of this shed and I first thought my first initial thoughts were I had found a deadhead or maybe one or two and the reason I thought maybe it was one or two as I think I said that in the video is uh, I don't know if they were fighting um, or what was going on because I found I you know I seen the top of this this shed just the just the uh, tines and maybe a part of the main beam if I remember right that's what was sticking out of the ice and right next to it was another shed as I walked up to it and got closer there were there were four sheds all within about a 10 foot circle on that ridge it was just like a little wet hole on top of that uh, ridge system like I said that 100 yard ridge, ridge top and uh, there was four sheds in one spot and when I I put the camera down and I went to trying to get that shed out of the uh, of the ice, I uh, what I found was something that I I'll never forget and it it actually ended a or it brought a a story um, of a buck full circle. So as I was getting this shed removed from the ice, um, breaking it away with my feet, trying because I didn't have any. Obviously, I was you know I didn't have any. Uh, I didn't have a hammer or anything like that. So luckily, the ice was soft enough that I was able to break uh, the slush and the the ice away with my boot, and reach down and grab the shed. And when I reached down and grabbed the shed, I pulled it out, and my first initial initial reaction was shock, and then I soon realized what I had found. I had found the side the right side this antler the right side of this buck that my father had shot that uh, that fall so not only did I find four sheds I found the shed off a of buck from the previous year that my father had shot uh, you know that this was March and he had shot that buck in November with me and uh, as you can see, he's uh, he's got you know this is quite a shed here. Um, I had taped it at one time. I can't remember all you know exact inches of it, but found this and pulled it out. Like I said, I knew as soon as I pulled it out that that was the that was the shed that I had found, and soon after was able to find my my father and uh, put it in his hands, and uh, we like we said we completed that uh, that story of that buck that was harvested that November. Really, really cool deal. Not something that you, that you, uh, you know, that happens all the time. And I was just fortunate, lucky, lucky enough to be able to get that, uh, capture that all on, on film. And the other sheds that were there were nothing uh, shabby, but they were not, not this shed. And they, they did not have the, obviously didn't have the story that comes along with this shed either. Michigan shed hunt. And it's uh, something I'll never forget. Thanks guys.